Hi everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel Mongoose Trading. So today's video is going to be on how to add moving averages into the RSI indicator window on your MetaTrader platform terminal on the computer. So this video I'm doing because I got a comment on somebody asking and just to show on how to add these. It's actually really simple. All you need to do is go to insert or go to indicators your oscillators and you just say relative strength index yeah you can add all your settings and like what type of settings you use just click ok so next we'll go to view and select navigator or just control in in the navigator navigator bar that opens you'll see indicators can click on the little plus sign next to trend and you can just click on moving average once it's selected you can just drag and drop it onto your RSI and here you can set all your settings that you want to note if I just leave it like this uh, moving average method exponential apply to close style dark blue press ok it's not going to show up in the RSI window so for it to show up in the RSI window, we'll do exactly the same again, drag and drop it. And here at apply to, you'll just go and say previous indicator data and press OK. Now you'll see that your moving average is on top of your RSI in the RSI box. You can add multiple moving averages by just doing the same. Setting previous indicator data, let's make it a purple with a 200 moving average. So simple, and we want a nice fin line, and you just press OK. Now you can see that both of your moving averages is inside your RSI window. You can add more than two moving averages depending on your type of strategy that you use. You can also add your Bollinger Band in the same method, just drag and, drag and drop it, say apply to, and you say previous indicator data, press ok. Now you can see as well your RSI has the Bollinger Band inside of it. That would be all for this video, if there is anything else that you guys need help with, just comment and I'll make try my best to make a video on how to help you with that. With that all said and done, thank you for watching my video. Please like and subscribe for more videos. Let me know in the comments if the content was helpful.